All right, we take a look at a forecast out there today. Uh, maybe not the best day for pools today because we're looking at showers and storms. You can see quite a big uh, amount of rain from Minneapolis stretching all the way down to southern Missouri, back on off from Kansas all the way on off to Raleigh Durham. So it is a pretty big system. Uh, we are on the northern extent of it, or really central northern extent of it. And what we're going to be dealing with here is. Um, a little bit of shower and storm activity this morning. You can see some areas of light thunderstorm activity. It's kind of dying out down around the southern extent of the storm. It's a little bit more potent here around Rockford. That will probably continue up towards Kenosha, and we just have some showers, maybe an isolated thunderstorm for most of us in Chicagoland this morning. This is not the rain we're concerned about. That comes later today. Flash flood watch is going to happen for us beginning at 1 o'clock today, lasting all the way through until 1 a.m. this morning for the green shaded counties. Basically, if you're north North of I-80, you're under the flash flood watch. If you're south of I-80, not so much. Heaviest rain will be north of that point, but everybody has the potential for some severe weather. It's a little bit stronger here across my Illinois counties where we have a slight risk zone. Watch as we roll into the afternoon with that chance of showers and storms a little strong here uh, into the 7 o'clock hour. Maybe get as early as around 4 and continues through until about 10 or 11 o'clock tonight. We could see some hail. We could see some damaging winds. Isolated tornadoes also possible as the storm storm system moves through. Once it does, we begin to open the door up to some intensely hot conditions that'll come into play this weekend. So if you're looking for a summer weekend where you can get the kiddie pool out, uh, this is your weekend coming up right here. But um, we've got to get through these storms first. So just keep an eye to the sky today. You will need your NOAA weather radios turned on, especially late afternoon, early evening. We're looking at low 80s today, tomorrow, but we're looking at near 90 on Thursday. And then there we go. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, mid 90s, Derek.